Welcome back. We're finally getting a break from the rain that we've had for the last couple of days over at the Spokane Airport, where it looks like we're far starting to pick up those partly cloudy conditions right now. 36 degrees at the moment at the airport. We are still seeing some light winds coming out of the south at this time across the region, mostly in the upper 30s, low 40s for us. So cool, but not freezing at the moment. And as we take a look at that satellite radar map, we saw those showers. We saw even at some lightning strikes at one point. We picked up some convective activity, so watch that really closely. But as we head into the next few days, there are some other changes. However, this is a concern that we're still watching right now. Thanks to that rain that we had moved through our region and those warm temperatures. A flood advisory still in effect for much of the panhandle of Idaho. Minor flooding is expected in some low lying areas, so just be aware of that. We're going to continue to watch those conditions, but headlines mild temperatures for tomorrow. Expect a mix of sun and clouds. Drier weekend weather ahead. That's all thanks to this ridge of high pressure that's looking to move into our region, looking to kind of stable stabilize things for us, so we're getting a break from some of that rainy those rainy conditions that we had for today. So heading into tonight and into tomorrow, we might see those partly cloudy skies and we start to clear out into those clearer conditions into our overnight hours and into our Saturday. A quick peek at our at our forecast at high temperatures tomorrow, mostly in the upper 40s, low 50s around the region. Meanwhile, for the next few days, you can see those temperatures mostly into the mid 40s for tomorrow for Spokane, upper 40s for the weekend, looking at quite a bit of sunshine. However, next week might bring us another chance for some moisture in your forecast.